With a population of 78 million and estimated GDP per capita of 12,300 in 2011, Turkish economy is one of the most dynamic emerging markets. It has been a member of the World Trade Organization since March of 1995. Spanning continents at the crossroads of Europe, Asia, and the Mediterranean, Aegean Sea, and Black Seas, its geographic location has made it a strategic country over the centuries. An aggressive privatization program has reduced state involvement in basic industry, banking, transport, and communication. And an emerging framework of middle class entrepreneurs is adding dynamism to the economy. Okay, I am Dr. Hale Kainak. I have been living in the US since 1989. I am from Turkey. Whether you work in private sector or public sector, uh, you, you make a difference. Uh, you, in private sector, it is more like an American company. You really work very hard. And uh, but if you are working in public sector, it is just you know. I mean, the, the environment is more relaxed. My name is Murat Can Erkul. Uh, I'm from Turkey. The uh, best part of Turkey is they call Izmir. Izmir is more relaxed. Maybe it's because of the culture. It's a mixture of Greek and Turkish culture. Mm -hmm. Istanbul is the biggest city, it's like kind of New York, of like New York for Turkey, so it has 16 million people live there, so. and lots of multinationals and some Turkish companies, large companies there, and the lifestyle in Istanbul is fast paced, everybody needs to be quick, the job needs to be done in time. I'm a graduate student in Texas, but I'm in the uh, manufacturing engineering department. In Turkey, it's, it doesn't matter how long you're working, like if you're even if you're working 70, 75 hours some, some week, uh, it doesn't matter, you, you'll get uh, stable money, same money end of the month. People like to socialize, you know, I mean, they like to have social relationships when they work. So it is uh, kind of, you cannot get into a meeting and just, you know, do business. The Turks are proud of both their achievements as a modern state and their rich heritage. <laughs>